Hey guys, and happy new year. Kelly from KW Naturals here with another video. A friend of mine requested I do a braid out video on my braid out technique. So if you like the hairstyle that you see here, stay tuned as I am reviewing new products as well. Let's get started. I have already washed and conditioned my hair with the Argan Oil of Morocco Shampoo and the Extra Strength Conditioner. Both products are sulfate and paraben free. They help with dry, damaged hair and add shine and softness. I also deep conditioned with the 3 Minute Miraculous Recovery Deep Conditioner which I left in while in the shower for 3 minutes before washing out with cool water. All these products are from Organic which all their products are under $10 and always available everywhere. Check out this line and a variety of other mixtures you can choose from and they smell so good. So now I'm just uh, parting my hair in two sections so that I can be able to add more water for moisture. My hair is feeling really good right now. One thing I didn't do was deep condition with another deep conditioner for 30 minutes. So I'm curious to see how my hair will turn out with just the minute, the three minute miraculous recovery conditioner. So I'm just smoothing out my ends and I'm just sectioning. To another section. Now I'm just detangling with my hands, just making sure that my hair is extremely detangled. Then I'm going to add more water. My hair comes out better on these kinds of styles when it is saturated with water. So you want your hair as damp as possible. Next, I'll be grabbing my conditioner, my leave in, I'll be using that as a leave in, and just adding that on my hair. Just to make sure that I'm getting, I've gotten all the sections loaded with deep conditioner. I'll be grabbing my dimming brush and as you can see I'm starting from the ends working my way up to detangle just to make sure I have all the kinks out. And this is pretty much standard for any style that I do. going to start sectioning off my hair to start my braids and this pretty much is kind of duplicate to what I do for my twist outs and now I'm adding in my Carol's daughter as you saw the picture there I'll be adding in my Carol's daughter styling pudding as one of my stylers and I'll be smoothing that out with my dimmer brush I'm also adding my boo my eco styler gel which I add on to just about every style because it helps define my curls and holds keeps in where I'm able to keep my style in for three to four days smoothing out once again now I'll begin to braid one technique I do do to make sure that my roots are smooth I start twisting first and then I go into a full braid and you'll see the residue from the styling cream and but as you dry this will go away I'm using firm rods which is usually my staple to protect my ends and you don't have to use the perm rods. I just like to use those because it just kind of makes my ends neat and tucks them in. And just do a second one for you, just so you can see.
Also stay tuned for more videos coming your way uh, for the new year. I have joined on with Curlbox and I'm excited to be starting a Curlbox video series soon. So go ahead and hit that subscribe button below so you don't miss out on those videos. I will be showing you what I received in my box. And here is my hair fully braided. I have sectioned in four parts and each part is about four to five braids in each section. And here is my final results. I have to say that my hair felt a little bit more dry due to maybe the three minute recovery. It maybe had a protein overload. Other than that, my hair feels great. To me, it looks more like my twist outs, just with a different curl pattern. Thanks so much for watching and excited for more videos to come this year. Like, comment, and subscribe, and thanks for all of your support.